What's up guys? I know it has been a while, but it is time to jump in here with a video again because there's been a little bit of an update. Um, the, for those of you who have followed the Malibu on the channel, the in-body Malibu that I've done a little bit of work on that's been my daily for quite a while now, um, the Malibu is gone. Unfortunately, about a week ago, I had a car accident in that car. The car did its job. It kept me from being hurt. I was not injured at all, but the underside of the car was damaged very badly. The airbags were deployed and the windshield was broken. So unfortunately, that being a car I didn't have a lot of money in, it just was not worth trying to fix. So unfortunately, it is gone. But I'm in need of another daily because unfortunately right now the 07 Grand Prix, which is sort of my other daily, is actually uh, overheating and we're gonna be doing videos on that too, but th that's another subject. But, so I needed another daily. I came across something that I think is gonna work splendidly and I'd like to introduce it to you now. So without further ado, here is the new car for the channel. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how So this is my new to me 2012 Chevrolet Cruze. This is the 1.4 turbo Ecotec motor. Here's a shot of that. And one of my favorite things and one of the things that really sold me on buying this car in the first place, this is the six speed manual version. And I have not been in a manual car in a while now and I'm looking really forward to driving that it is black interior black exterior it has 77,000 miles on it and uh, I've been driving it to and from work for a couple days and I really like it it has the RS package which is mostly just a cosmetic package it has you know the little spoiler it has a different bumper it has uh, fog lights which the base models don't have but the star of the show, as far as fun things for me to mess with. Oh, and before I get that far, let me just say, so far I have been averaging 38 miles to the gallon in this car, which as much as I drive, and I drive a lot, that is gonna save me a lot of money, so I'm very happy about that too. But this is what I'm sort of excited about. This little 1.4 Ecotec, which is another platform that is supported by ZZP, which I'm sort of excited about. But also I've been studying a lot about this engine. Not only are they very easy to work on being four cylinders and also as you can see being in an engine bay that has just an absolute ton of space for the size of this motor. But it's also factory turbo, boosted motors generally take two modifications better than non-boosted motors do. And uh, it's just, it's a good design. It's easy to work on. The gas mileage is impressive. Stock horsepower is not anything to brag about, but they are very moddable. There's a lot of stuff you can do to them. I am not going to go crazy with this. This is gonna be my to and from work car, but there are some things we can do. I will make some videos on that. And uh, that is definitely gonna happen. Uh, looking at the interior, Another reason I got this car, it's small, it's lightweight, but it has enough space for kids in the back, and my kids are almost not kids anymore, so having space for them is kind of important. Um, and just, yeah, so far I'm really liking the car. I don't have a huge amount of experience with these, but I have done uh, my homework a bit, and I knew this was going to be a platform I would like. Uh, the low mileage being 77,000 miles makes it by far and away the lowest mileage car I own and uh, should make it a little less 
of a hassle to maintain and keep up as it doesn't need as much right now but uh that's it for right now that's pretty much the point of this video you will see this in videos soon i am anxious to see what you guys think about this platform if you're excited to see videos about it etc etc so drop that down in the comments and let me know other than that i am gone for this one like i said the 07 is on the mend right now so we're gonna be making videos on fixing that up pretty soon uh, another exciting thing the 99 GTP is going to be back to road duty soon. It has a full tank of E85. I have a couple little mods I want to do to make it a little more streetable. And then we're gonna be driving that thing again. So it's gonna be going back to the drag strip. It's gonna be going to work sometimes. I mean, it's good to get it back, you know, in full function. And also I've got some more work to do on this Honda Accord and it will be street worthy pretty soon. This is the V6 Honda Accord I bought for my son. And uh, so we'll talk about that some more too in future videos. But uh, that's pretty much it. Today is uh, check out the cruise day. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, make sure you're subscribed. Like this video if you like anything about it. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. And peace.